we're going to tell everybody first we're here at Bulldog Cycles. Yeah. In downtown Omer Oler, we're right in the middle on the Highway 301 321. It's our 13 year anniversary here at the bike shop. And we're also, we asked for a support party. I want to tell y'all, we got it. We really did. We want to thank all our brothers and sisters for coming today. I want to thank my wife, Roxy. She was right here. She's gone. I want to thank her for everything she did to put this thing on. There she is. And I want to thank my brother, Charles. He did all the cooking. And it was great, wasn't it? Wasn't it? Yeah, yeah, it was. My name's Pat, and I'm, we're from St. Helena. This is my first time here. and it's been fun. It's been good. Yeah, and, uh, and we, which guys did you come down here with? I came down with the CMA with Dan Duffy and Raymond. All right. Dennis Blass and my brother-in-law. We rode up from St. Helena and Buford area. Oh, so cool. Yeah, yeah. Well, well uh, Franco's son is over that way around Buford, I think. Yeah, my brother-in-law knows him. Yeah, Patrick. oh, cool, man. Yeah. Small so, world, ain't it? It is. Man, yeah. I'll tell you what, bro. This is... To have you guys out here riding in the rain or whatever means a lot. Well, thank you. It I mean, shows where your heart goes. Right. Well, we all got to... You know, we try to give everybody support that, you know, and, it, and this is a good cause and a good deal. Oh, yeah, well, anytime that we're out here and Jesus is the center, it ain't about the bikes. Nope. It ain't about the ride. It's about riding for Jesus and being out here for the Lord and blessing our brothers and sisters. All right, we we are we here with Kenmore, and where about you from? I'm from Yemisee, Yemisee, South Carolina. All right. Oh yeah, yeah, we know where that's at, and and, uh, and you come up here with these guys too. No, I'm kind of like solo in it. I All just right. happened to come by the other day, and I seen uh, Pappy sitting outside, and he yeah. flagged me down, and I stopped and talked to him. And I said, "Well, I'll come back Saturday." Ain't you glad you did? Man? Oh yeah. And uh, he's an old trucker, like several of us in our group, and uh, there's always something there. But now it's just about Jesus, and you retired from there, right? No, I'm tired, but I'm not retired. <laughs> <laughs> well, is there anything you don't tell the folks out there? Yeah, come on by here to Pappy. He'll take care of you. Enough said, I think. Next. All right, we over here with uh, Brother Glenn, or Gray Wolf here, and Pappy, while they're sitting down here just chewing the fat. And uh, Brother Glenn, what do you got to say to the folks out there? Just trust in Jesus. He's the only one that can make it for you. He's the only way. Coming down here is a blessing. I haven't seen Pops for um, about, no, no, about, I uh, came down um February. Okay, I haven't seen him about since February. But uh, it's nice seeing him again. He's doing real good. Uh, he's a blessing to me. Anyway, Tex, uh, where about you from? Uh, just outside Corpus Christi, Texas. Oh. That's how I got the name Tex. Right. But yeah, it's good to have you here. Yeah, it's great getting so, here. So, uh, where you stayed around here? I'm actually from West Columbia. Really? Mm -hmm. I ride up. Uh, and Roxy and Peppy called me and told me what we were doing. I rode up and uh, I believe in Christ. Oh, well, good. good. Yeah, and and uh, <laughs> and we know that area well. It's good to have you here. It's great being here. You saying you don't tell folks out there? Uh, the Bulldog Cycles is a great place to come, to come and, and rejoice mm -hmm. with the Lord. Yeah, we're here at Brother Gordon. And uh, where are you from, Gordon? Newberry County, Prosperity. Newberry. All right, well, yeah, man. Uh, and uh, he rode down here with us this morning. Uh, he didn't know he was coming. <laughs> uh, he went to our men's group this morning, and uh, we kept him. And bless his heart, he rode through the rain, and uh, like a lot of the guys, and, and we thank you for that, man. Yeah. All right, brother. Rain man here. Uh, Another guy that I've just met, and uh, I think Mikey and the rest of them have met him before, but uh, it's good to meet you, brother. And we know what a good friend you've been to Pappy and the rest of the guys, and, and that means a lot. Because, like, when you got folks that lift each other up like we've been talking about, and if you don't know Jesus, then you don't know what we're talking about. Absolutely. But that's why it's so important. So important. What would you like to say about yourself here, brother? It's raining outside, and I got to get on my bike. <laughs> well, let's see here. What's your point? <laughs> uh, we're hearing all kind of good stuff here. <laughs> the 
talking with Mac here. He's the last one of the bunch here. Several of them have slipped out on us, but uh, we're going to get him now. So, uh, yeah, Mac. Make sure you get Rain Man. Yeah, Rain Man. Oh, yeah, Rain Man. Well, he ain't gone nowhere yet, so, you know. But like it is, Mac here, uh, where about you from? Beaufort, St. Helen uh, Island. Oh, yeah, on, on the good side out, John. And, and uh, man, we appreciate you guys riding up here. Yeah, man, it was good. Uh, good time to come up and fellowship with some brothers. Yeah, that's, that's right. And, and, and uh, Biker for Christ. And well, Lone Biker for Christ in the Low Country. <laughs> hey, well, yeah, they got a representative down there. They got one. They got one. I, I didn't realize this moment was going to come, and I'm glad it did because I forgot to say something a minute ago. Uh, been praying real hard while I've been down on my back about what God has in store and wants Roxy and I to do. And we know that ministering through the bike shop has been top of the heap. And uh, we do try to make this a lighthouse for people and make them welcome and uh, talk about the Lord and, and, and minister. But one of the things, had a couple of my real close brothers prayed with me today and ministered to me. Believe it or not, we need ministered to. We really do sometimes. We just uh, we talk to the Lord and we pray to the Lord, and He puts it on our heart. Well, you need to talk to one of your brothers because He knows what I want you to do too. And uh, we are going to start here at Bulldog Cycle in the very, very, very near future. We are going to start a weekly Bible study. Yeah. We lift each other up. That's what we're supposed to do, and that's part of being. Uh, a disciple. Anybody ask me, I'm a follower of Jesus. I don't care what nobody else is. I'm a follower of Christ. And and to hear our brothers here and soon to be our sisters, we're going to hit them next, I think. And and, and we, we just know that Jesus is the center. And, and that's what the Father said. He said, you ain't coming to me except by my son, Jesus. 